Now, the latest development from Google that it describes as a state-of-the-art quantum computer chip. The company claims Willow leapfrogs over the supercomputers that we're used to, we used to consider the world's fastest, and it takes five minutes for them to solve a problem that would currently take supercomputers 10 septillion years to complete. Throughout human history, the quest to understand the nature of reality has been a defining pursuit of science, philosophy, and spirituality. What is the universe made of? How do the laws of physics govern it? And the most profound question of all, does reality exist as we perceive it, or is it a mere construct of our minds? Recently, a revolutionary development in quantum computing has reignited these questions. Scientists have created a new quantum chip so advanced that it has shaken the very foundations of our understanding of reality. The implications of this discovery are nothing short of paradigm shifting. According to the data generated by this quantum chip, the universe may not exist as we know it. Let's start with the basics. Quantum mechanics is the branch of physics that deals with the behavior of particles at the smallest scales, atoms and subatomic particles. At these scales, the rules of classical physics, the ones that describe the motion of planets, cars, or even a thrown baseball, no longer apply. Instead, particles seem to exist in multiple states at once, a phenomenon known as superposition. They can also affect each other instantaneously over vast distances, a phenomenon called entanglement. These strange behaviors have long puzzled scientists and challenged our understanding of what it means for something to exist. The creation of this new quantum chip has taken our understanding of these phenomena to a whole new level. Designed to operate at unprecedented speeds and handle vastly more qubits than previous models, this chip has allowed scientists to simulate quantum systems with a precision never before possible. The results of these simulations have led to a startling conclusion. The universe may not have a physical foundation. To understand why, we need to delve into one of the most debated interpretations of quantum mechanics, the idea that reality is observer-dependent. This stems from the famous double-slit experiment. When particles like electrons are shot at a barrier with two slits, they behave like waves, creating an interference pattern on a screen behind the barrier. But here's the strange part. If you place a detector at the slits to observe which slit each particle passes through, the interference pattern disappears. The particles start behaving like particles again, as though the very act of observation determines their behavior. This has led to the unsettling conclusion that particles don't have definite properties until they are observed. Instead, they exist in a state of probability a mathematical description of all the possible states they could be in. It's as if reality itself doesn't solidify until a conscious observer looks at it. Now, let's connect this to the breakthrough in quantum computing. The new quantum chip has enabled scientists to run simulations of quantum systems on an unprecedented scale. One of the key experiments involved simulating the behavior of particles in a universe governed purely by quantum mechanics. The results were astonishing. The simulation suggested that particles only exhibit classical physical properties when observed by an external system. In other words, the universe as we experience it, solid, physical, and governed by deterministic laws, may be nothing more than a construct that emerges when we observe it. Without observation, the universe exists as a mathematical abstraction, a cloud of probabilities with no definitive reality. This aligns with the philosophical concept of non-realism which posits that the physical world is not objectively real. Instead, it's a kind of shared illusion created by our consciousness interacting with the underlying quantum fabric of reality. This idea has profound implications for how we understand existence. If reality is not objectively real, then what does it mean to say that something exists? To answer this question, we must confront the nature of consciousness itself. For centuries, scientists and philosophers have debated the relationship between mind and matter. Is consciousness a product of the brain, or is it something more fundamental, a fundamental aspect of the universe itself? The data from the quantum chip suggests the latter. The simulations revealed a strange phenomenon. In a universe without conscious observers, the quantum systems never collapsed into a definitive state. They remained in a superposition a kind of limbo where all possibilities coexisted. 
This strongly implies that consciousness is not just an emergent property of physical systems like the brain. Instead, it seems to play a fundamental role in shaping reality itself. Some physicists have taken this a step further, proposing that consciousness may be the only thing that truly exists. This is reminiscent of the ancient philosophical concept of idealism, which holds that reality is fundamentally mental rather than physical. From this perspective, the universe is not a physical place where events happen independently of observers. Instead, it's a kind of shared dream, a mental construct created by the interplay of countless conscious minds. This idea may sound far-fetched, but it is supported by some of the most puzzling phenomena in quantum mechanics. For example, quantum entanglement shows that particles can influence each other instantaneously, even when separated by vast distances. This has led some scientists to propose that the universe is fundamentally interconnected, with all particles existing as part of a single, unified whole. The new quantum chip has provided further evidence for this interconnectedness. By simulating the behavior of entangled particles on a massive scale, scientists found that the connections between particles were not limited by space or time. This suggests that the universe is not a collection of separate objects interacting through physical forces. Instead, it's a seamless web of relationships where the distinction between here and there or now and then breaks down. If this is true, then our everyday experience of reality is a kind of illusion. The objects we see, the spaces we inhabit, and even the passage of time are all constructs that emerge from the underlying quantum fabric of the universe. This doesn't mean that reality is fake or unimportant, far from it. But it does mean that reality is far stranger and more complex than we ever imagined. One of the most profound implications of this discovery is its impact on our understanding of free will and determinism. In a classical deterministic universe, every event is the inevitable result of preceding causes. But in a quantum universe, the future is not fixed. Instead, it exists as a range of probabilities influenced by the choices we make as conscious observers. This suggests that free will may not be an illusion, as some scientists have argued. Instead, it could be a fundamental aspect of reality, a way for consciousness to shape the unfolding of the universe. This idea has profound ethical and philosophical implications, challenging us to take responsibility for the reality we create through our choices and perceptions. But the implications don't stop there. The discovery that the universe is not objectively real also challenges our understanding of technology and artificial intelligence. If consciousness is fundamental to reality, then creating truly intelligent machines may require more than just building complex systems of algorithms. It may require understanding and replicating the quantum processes that give rise to consciousness itself. This raises questions about the nature of artificial intelligence and its potential to reshape our world. Could a sufficiently advanced AI develop its form of consciousness, becoming not just a tool, but a participant in the creation of reality? And if so, what ethical responsibilities would we have toward these new forms of life? The quantum chip has also opened up new possibilities for exploring the universe. By harnessing the strange properties of quantum mechanics, Future technologies could allow us to manipulate reality in ways that were once thought impossible. Imagine a spacecraft that uses quantum entanglement to communicate instantaneously across vast distances, or a medical device that harnesses quantum superposition to heal tissues at the molecular level. These possibilities are not just speculative. They are grounded in the same principles that underlie the quantum chip's revolutionary simulations. By continuing to explore these principles, we can unlock new technologies that have the potential to transform our world, and perhaps even our understanding of what it means to be human. But with great power comes great responsibility. As we venture further into the quantum realm, we must grapple with the ethical and philosophical challenges posed by this new understanding of reality. How do we ensure that these technologies are used for the benefit of all? rather than for the enrichment of a few. How do we navigate the potential risks of manipulating a reality that is far more complex and interconnected than we ever imagined? These are questions that will define the next chapter of human history. The discovery that the universe is not objectively real is not an endpoint. It is a beginning.
It challenges us to think more deeply, act more responsibly, and dream more boldly than ever before. In the end, the quantum chip's greatest contribution may not be the answers it provides, but the questions it forces us to ask. By challenging our assumptions and expanding our horizons, it invites us to see the universe and ourselves in a new light. In doing so, it reminds us that the quest to understand reality is not just a scientific endeavor, it is a profoundly human one, driven by the same curiosity and wonder that has inspired us since the dawn of time. The quantum chip's implications extend far beyond physics, delving into the very fabric of human existence. To comprehend the full magnitude of its revelations, we must venture into uncharted territory, exploring how this breakthrough reshapes not only science, but also our worldview, our place in the cosmos, and the future of humanity. Let us embark on this journey with open minds and hearts, driven by the same wonder that has fueled exploration since the dawn of time. The quantum chip invites us to participate in the unfolding cosmic story, recognizing that every choice, thought, and observation shapes reality. In this vast, interconnected web of existence, we are both explorers and creators, discovering that the greatest revelations lie not just in the answers we find, but in the questions we dare to ask.